Hey, baby. How's your day been? Yeah? That's good. Or bad. Sorry, I'm pretty zoned out. I didn't hear what you said. <sighs> no, I'm sorry. Stupid. I shouldn't ask a question and then forget to listen to the answer. It's a bad habit. Yeah, I mean, maybe not just a bad habit. It hasn't been the best day for me. I'm feeling kind of distracted. Ugh. You know, it just seems like one of those days where everything around me reminded me of what I don't like about my own life. What kind of things? Well, I mean, I'm not too happy with my job at the moment. Or where I live. Or being apart from you. That was the main thing. That was the only thing, to be honest. <sighs> yeah. This long distance thing is hard. It's easy to forget sometimes just how hard it is. Because things with you are so great. But then, you know, I see other couples out in the real world actually getting to spend time together. And it doesn't seem fair. All I want is that with you. It's not so much to ask, is it? No, of course not. I'm not angry about it. Definitely not angry with you. It's not as though it's your fault that we don't live close to each other. <laughs> Actually, it was pretty daft of you not to be born in the same place as me. What were you thinking? Yeah, <laughs> I know. I made the same mistake. But then, if you were born where I was born, and I was born where you were born, we'd still be just as far apart. So only one of us should go back in time and change where we're born. Not both of us. Yeah, if you could get on that, that'd be great. Hop in your time machine. <laughs> uh, it's so easy to cheer up when I'm around you. Even if I'm feeling sad and mopey about the distance or whatever else. You bring out a goofy side of me. It feels good to try to stay positive. Right. Besides, I know it's not going to be like this forever. We'll see each other one day. One day soon, I hope. Yeah. It feels like destiny, you know? I don't have a choice in the matter. I have to see you one day, and soon. That, or I'll lose my mind, I guess. Oh, I don't know when. It's hard to know when it'll feel like the right time. Right now, with work and everything, I don't know. Just feels like there'll always be a reason not to at this exact moment, as much as I want to. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I could just take the time off. You're right, I could. If I have some time off saved up, they wouldn't mind. You know, I bet I could get my sister to look after my cat as well. She loves that cat. Are you saying that I should just, like, do it? Now? For real? <laughs> okay. Shit, I mean... Well, now the idea's in my head. I don't know how I could get it out. Let's... Let's do it. Yeah. For real, let's do it. I, uh... I seem I can stay at yours, right? Or do you want me to book a hotel room nearby? No, okay. Stupid question. Of course. Uh, let's look at plane tickets. I have no idea how much they'll be, but I've got a little bit in savings. I'll pay whatever it is. Oh, seriously? You'll go halves? <laughs> Fuck yeah. Okay. It's looking like they'll be around. I hate trying to find my way around airports. Where are you supposed to... Oh! Hey! I'm here. Hey. Uh. Uh. Oh my god, it's so good to see you. I can't believe that... I can't... Sorry, I can't get my words straight. Um, it's just so good to finally see you. Yeah. It's just not the same as seeing you on a video call. This is so much more real. I mean, obviously. But I, I just can't... <laughs> You're actually there. In front of me. Hold on, I need to check this is real again. I 
hope you aren't going to get bored of that anytime soon, because there are a lot more where that came from. I, I love what you're wearing, by the way. Isn't that what you... It, yeah, it is. It's what you were wearing the first time we video called. You did that deliberately, didn't you? <laughs> no, I don't think it's dumb. I think it's cute. I'm honestly impressed that you remembered what you wore and that you thought to wear it again today. It's like... Man, you're really thoughtful. <laughs> I wouldn't have thought to do something like that. Shit. I didn't even get you a present or anything. I probably should have, right? I'm sorry, it's the first time I'm doing this kind of thing. I don't know what you're supposed to do. You sure it doesn't matter? Sure you sure? <sighs> Phew. Okay. <laughs> Good. I thought I'd fucked up. I mean, I know you're not that materialistic or anything, but still. Sorry, I... <laughs> I think the nerves are getting to me a little. I didn't expect to feel nervous about this, but it's such a big deal to me. Yeah, so please forgive me if I say anything stupid. I'm sure I will at some point. <laughs> yes, you're right. I say stupid things on call all the time. I don't know why I'm worried about it now. I'll try to forget about it. Do you want to get out of here? Yeah, I mean, uh, I don't care what we do as long as I get to spend time with you. But it might be a little better if we aren't surrounded by hundreds of people at an airport, right? Hmm. How far's your place? I should have asked before now. Oh, that's not so bad. Shall we, uh, head over there, then? Sorry if it seems like I'm rushing things, but, uh, I'm kind of knackered. <laughs> Been a long time since I was on an airplane. I forgot how bad I was at sleeping on those things. Ah, uh, I'm so glad we're on the same wavelength. You definitely don't need to worry about not driving. Just teach me how to use the public transport system here and we'll be good. Let's go. I want to see your place. Ooh, it looks so much nicer than it did on call. Bigger than I imagined. You've definitely done a little tidying up for me, haven't you? <laughs> but you have a nice place. Did you put those fairy lights up for me? <laughs> if you did, that's incredibly sweet. <sighs> Damn, I look so cozy in here. I'm really being treated by you, huh? Well, I'm okay with that. Uh, where am I sleeping? You only have the one bedroom, right? <laughs> yeah, how dare you not get a bigger apartment for me. Can't cost that much, can it? <laughs> uh, but actually... Um, should I take the sofa? Do you have some spare bedding I can use? I didn't think to bring a pillow. Or a blanket. Oh, uh... uh are you sure? I mean, I mean, I don't want to make you uncomfortable. I really don't mind taking the sofa, it's totally fine. Okay. If you're sure, you're sure. I mean, I would much rather sleep in an actual bed. And, hell, if you just so happen to be in the bed as well, so much the better, right? Yeah. My thoughts exactly. So, you're going to hate me, but you know how I said I was super tired at the airport? Yeah, well, I don't know what it is, but something about actually being in your place for the first time has woke me right back up again. I feel wired. Um, where should I put my clothes and stuff? Like, where do you want me to unpack? You already made room for my stuff in your drawers? Oh, my God. You really are too thoughtful. Thank you. I'm going to do my best not to think about how I'm only here for a week. You're right. I'm here forever, for sure. But, damn, if I'm staying here forever, the airline must have lost a bunch of my clothes. There's only enough here for, what, six or seven days? Right, exactly. I would have packed more than that, because I'm definitely not only staying for a week. <laughs> I'm glad it's not awkward, you know? I, I think it's the same for any... Long distance couple. A bit of fear that somehow the chemistry you have online won't be there in person? 
Did you worry about that? Or was it just me being silly? Um, no, I mean, I wasn't properly worried. Like, I didn't think it would be a problem. I knew it was nothing more than unjustified anxiety. But still, it was there. A little niggle at the back of my mind. I feel so silly now. Of course we were always going to get on in person. <sighs> right, I like you too much not to get on with you. <sighs> That's all my stuff unpacked. I'll just slide this suitcase under the bed, I guess. <sighs> my body can't make its mind up. I was tired at the airport, wired when I walked through your door, and now I feel sleepy again. <sighs> you might have had a little lie down. <sighs> Thank you. I'm so... <sighs> oh, so tired. Mm. Your bed is so comfy. Comfier than mine. I'm envious. Yeah. No, that's not the worst thing about my bed. The worst thing. <laughs> the worst thing about it is... Oh, no, I'm sorry, I can't. I was going to make the worst joke you've ever heard. <laughs> I was going to say, the worst thing about my bed is that you aren't in it every night. But I didn't. I didn't just make that joke. Except I just did, but I lampshaded it, so that makes it okay. You, you're feeling tired too? How come? Oh, yeah, I probably wouldn't have got much sleep last night either. If it was the other way around and you were coming to me, I'd be up all night, I reckon. Wish I could have helped you sleep like I normally would. But, you know, video calling on a plane... Not going to work too well. But anyway, if you're tired, there's still plenty of room here. We're going to be sharing tonight anyway, so you might as well get used to it. Hmm. Hey, you can cuddle up if you want. It's what we've both been waiting for, right? <sighs> so sleepy. I'm gonna... I'm gonna sleep now. <laughs> Wake me up in a few hours or something. I kissed you? No, I wouldn't have done that. I'd remember if I had. I can if you want, though. It's like a dream. But I'm about to pass out, so see you in a few hours. <sighs>